Hey everybody, this is Dr. Fryer, and in this video I want to teach you how you can increase the volume of a video that you have made with iMovie on an iPad. This will also work on an iPhone, and I think it's even faster and easier to do this on an iOS device rather than your desktop computer. But you could use the full version of iMovie too, it's just going to look a little bit different. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to open up my iMovie application, and I've already got the video that I want to uh, you know, work on the volume saved in my camera roll. So I'm just going to create a new project and I am going to drop the video that I would like. And in this case, it's one that one of our teachers has given to me. And so I've selected it there and I'm just going to click create movie. So it's just going to create a movie with this single video here. And um, it is actually, this is interesting, it's actually zoomed in a little bit on the video um, to make it fill the screen a little bit more. When you shoot video, you want to try to not have your, your camera vertical. Uh, you want to try to shoot it horizontally. And so it's zoomed in just a little bit on that. So I'm going to ta uh, tap on the clip here below, and I'm going to tap on volume. And you can see that it's set to 100. Well, here in iMovie, I can increase it as much as 500%. Let's see if that's too loud. Hola, niños y niñas. Señora López. Okay, that's good. It's even louder. So basically, all I've done here is imported the audio clip, and I've just edited the volume. I haven't done anything else. Um, if I wanted to be fancier with this, you know, I could fade out or whatever, but I'm not going to do anything else because that's all that uh, Señora López asked me to do. Notice how her head is cut off a little bit here, though. I think I am going to need to uh, do some framing of the video uh, with the zoom. And so I'm going to click on... I don't want to cut off her head. Uh, so I'm going to pinch to zoom. I'm going to, I'm going to make this a little bit larger, but let's see how that is. Cause I just don't, I don't want her head to be cut off at all. So make sure as we go here to the end. Yep. That looks good. Okay, great. I'm done. So now I'm going to tap done. The last step is I'm going to do my share square here and I'm going to say save video. And I'm going to choose HD 720. The reason I'm not choosing 1080 is because 720 is plenty of quality, but the larger the video is, the longer it takes to upload uh, as a teacher or, who, or a student, whoever's making it, it takes it longer to send it to the internet, and then it can also take longer to download uh, for your students. So that just makes it uh, a little more user-friendly. So that's how you can do that editing. If you'd like to have more tips, you can visit our instructional technology support website for Cassidy School, which you can find on support.cassidy.org. Click the modules link that you'll find there, and you'll be able to go to different modules that will give you some tips like the one that you've seen here. Good luck to everybody.